All right, we're back here for Banshee Weapons, and I got the tower to myself, which is nice. Just me. Nobody else is here. That's wonderful, so we can do a nice review here and not get bothered by anybody. No, I'm just kidding. All right, you're, you're Banshee. Uh, I'm Banshee. I'm going to do this. I'm doing it myself. Yeah, I don't need you anymore. All right, so we're going to get into here, see what this maniac has this week. Let's check out all his new stuff. Thank you, everybody who returns and watches the video. You guys are awesome. Thank you for supporting. So we're going to check this stuff out. Real quick, we're going to hear a word from our sponsor. Today's sponsor is BlazingBoost.com. They're one of the best player pro service providers on the market. They provide a completely safe player pro services for games like Destiny 2, Lost Ark, and Apex Legends. If you don't have anyone to play with or if you simply don't want to bother with toxic teammates through LFG for the Master Dungeons and Raids, Blazing Boost can provide you with amazing people to play with, completely safe and Sherpa. Check out their weekly discount section. I'm sure you'd have something that you'd love to do with a pro, completely safe and Sherpa. If you have any doubts, just check out their trust follow page with over 34,000 five-star reviews. By the way, here's my discount code, JimBB5. That helps me out a lot directly. If you buy from the website, use my discount code and you'll save an extra 5%. Thank you, Blazing Boost, for sponsoring this video. One more real quick thing. Here you guys are made plugs. You can save 10% with the code ASUS and save your hearing. And yes, ASUS is my band. Go check out my last video. And I got a new song and video coming out this week. So thank everybody that supports and uh, check out my merch and all that other crap. And here we go. All right. So just the weekly reset video. There's something new. So go check that out. Let's get into this. All right. Whispering Slab, Combat Bow, Recall Direction Sloppy at 55. Uh, sloppy sloppy we got high tension string and then natural strings gonna drop your accuracy give you stability and handling and a quicker draw time we got fiberglass arrow shaft i got one of those too it helps out and uh natural reflection will give you some stability at the cost of accuracy increased accuracy stability and handling when firing while crouched make sure you sit down reloading after a final blow also reloads stowed weapons and draw time masterwork to make it quicker we got Plank's Stride Machine Gun doing arc damage. Recall Direction 66 and falling to the left just a little bit. Alright, slightly faster reload when magazine is empty, so empty it out. We got Extended Barrel, Full Bore is going to give you some range and handling at the cost of stability. And Recall Direction is going to go down to 56, get sloppy and pull to the right. We got Appended Mag, Extended Mag is going to drop your reload speed, but give you ammo and effect in this for all you jump machine gunners. And uh, give you like seven in the magazine. Grants increased reload speed when close to full magazine. Okay. Final blows with this weapon generate melee energy. Dealing melee damage briefly improves this weapon's handling. And a right hook. Dealing melee damage gives this weapon increased target acquisition and range for a short period of time. Dealing melee damage again extends the effect. And we have a reload master jerk because that definitely helps out in machine guns. They're nice and slow. Contingency plan scout rifle doing some arc damage. Recall direction sloppy at 53 and pulling to the left. We got decent aim assistance on this one though. And again, slightly faster reload when magazine is empty. You got full bore. Hammer forwards rifling to give you some stability and handling at the cost of range. Accurized rounds. Tactical mag is going to drop your range, give you stability, stability and handling, and one more in the magazine. Aiming this weapon for a short period reduces flinch. Then killing combatants with this weapon generates a small amount of super energy that helps and a range master jerk. Alright. Escape velocity submachine gun. Recall directions 80 in pulling to the right. Alright, not too sloppy, but submachine guns are sloppy to start out with. But handling is 80, so this might be kind of decent. We got the IS-2 classic. And the Model 8 Ray is going to give you some range at the cost of handling. And a little bit of zoom. We got accurized rounds. Flad Magwell is going to drop your range, give you stability and handling. Melee final blows reload this weapons magazine from reserves. Increased damage against bosses, vehicles, and guardians with the super active and a range master jerk. All right, Widow's Bite Sniper Rifle. Doing some solo damage, recall direction 70, pulling to the left. Aim assistance is 69. That's how I like to aim. All right, again, slightly faster reload when magazine is empty. We've got chambered compensate, a fluted barrel to drop your stability, give you some handling, and recoil direction goes down to 60, which is very sloppy, and pulls to the right. we got a pendant mag. Tactical mag is going to give you stability, reload speed, both stability and reload speed. Picking up heavy ammo also grants ammo to this weapon. This weapon can be drawn unbelievably fast, so fast, and a stability master jerk. All right, we're halfway done. 
And thank you, everybody who joins in. Give the video a little like, and uh, two more people will see it for each like. That's amazing, which means uh, one more person might watch it. Okay, syncopation 53, pulse drive. We'll do in stasis damage. In recoil direction is 79, and pulling to the right a little. Well run and grip, reliable and sturdy. I've got that tattoo. All right, polygonal rifling. Small bore is going to give you range at the cost of stability. Faster reloads when magazine is empty. Light mag for some range and reload speed. Causing damage with this weapon reduces recoil and flinch over time. Increased damage against bosses, vehicles, and guardians with the super active. And reloading grants this weapon bonus handling and reduces incoming flinch for a short time. And a range master jerk. Stability 69. That's some good stability there. All right, Lod Brock. How you doing, Lod Brock? Ah, I would have changed my name to that. All right, range is 83. That's kind of nice. Recoil direction is 100 straight up the middle. That's kind of nice. Slow fire and high damage. That's pretty good. We got arrowhead break. Chambered compensators going to give you some stability at the cost of handling. Recoil direction goes down to 98. That's not that bad. Ricochet rounds. Of course, it ricochets of hard surfaces. It's better indoors. Light mag, drop your stability, give you some reload speed. Improves accuracy and stability while continuously holding down the trigger. That's what you do with an auto rifle, it makes sense. Reloading after a kill grants increased damage. And this weapon deals increased damage against vehicles, turrets, barricades, and stasis crystals. Then a handle and master jerk. The cantata. Okay, hand cannon doing arc damage, recoil direction is 85. A lot of impact there, 84, some decent range and aim assistance, not bad. We got a hammer forged rifle and polygonal rifle to drop your range, give you some stability. Appended mag, tactical mag, give you stability and reload speed. Rapid precision hits temporarily increase stability and reload speed. Increased damage against bosses, vehicles, and guardians with their super active. And reloading grants his weapon bonus handling and reduces income and flinch for a short time. And a range master jerk. So that should be kind of a nice hard hitter. The Fiat Order. Sidearm doing void damage. Recoil direction is 95 straight up the middle there. And, uh, okay, not too bad, not too bad. Uh, full auto, that's nice. And slightly faster reload. The magazine is empty. We got corkscrew rifle and fluted barrels. Going to drop your range and give you some handling. High caliber rounds to knock the target back. Ricochet rounds to bounce off surfaces. Give you more stability too. Increased reload stability and handling when enemies are in close proximity. Final blows grant additional weapon range. Stability and accuracy when firing from the hip for a short duration. Reloading grants his weapon bonus handle and reduces income and flinch for a short time. And a handle and master jerk. Lots of handle and jerks. We got memory interdict grenade launcher. Doing void damage. Recoil direction 71. Pulling to the left. Decent blast radius. That's your damage. We got confined launch. Hard launch is going to drop that blast radius. And stability will give you velocity. That's the speed. How quick it travels. Alloy casing, mini frags to drop your blast radius again and reload speed, but give you stability in one of the magazine. Yeah, I'd keep the top on. Uh, massively increases projectile velocity, increases reload speed. The blast radius of this weapon increases when surrounded by combatants. While active, this weapon deals significantly less damage to the wielder. That helps. And a handling master jerk again with the handling. Uh, geodetic hism. Well, uh, you got some void damage there. Ah, oh, that went right on the thing. That looks nice. Ammo capacity 67. All right, it's kind of uh, kind of evened out there. Not too bad. Let's see what we got. We got Enduring Blade. Honed Edge is going to give you a little bit of impact at the cost of ammo capacity. Then Jagged Edge gives you more impact, takes away more ammo. We got Balanced Guard. And then uh, oh, others going to give you a little more charge rate and take down your guard resistance. Sword Ammo granted for every other powered sword kill. Final blows cause nearby targets to become volatile. And sustained fire increases accuracy and range, increases lunge distance for swords and projectile velocity for launches, and an impact master work, which is your damage. So that's nice. All right, thank you for joining in. You guys are awesome. You are amazing. Thank you for supporting the channel. And go check out my other stuff. Check out my band Aces. New song coming out this week. New video. All excited about it. And uh, thank you, everybody, who supports. You guys are amazing. So I'll see you in the next video. Thank you, Guardians. Later.